Hi, babe, it's Vidic here, and a welcome back to Navite. By killing any monster or player in the wilderness, you can get lucky and get rewarded with a wilderness key. These are brought out to a chest deep in the wilderness for a chance at some really good rewards. So in today's video, we've got 300 of these colored wilderness keys, and we are going to open them all. Now, before we get into everything, I'm giving away 500 donator tickets. We're going to have two winners that get 250 tickets each. All you got to do to answer is like the video, subscribe to my channel, turn on post notifications, and leave your Navite in-game name down below. So for this video, we actually set up a second account. That way, I would have a completely empty bank. It's much easier to see all the loot that I get. With a little bit of cash, we just bought a basic range setup so I can tank magic hits and do a little bit of fighting back if necessary. All right, so I believe this is going to be optimal for us. As many Cerebrews and Super Stores as you can really hold. All right, so I made a couple changes here. I'm going to need a Super Energy Potion. We're going to need a Dragon Dagger for the webs. And I thought about bringing a Pack Yak, but... I don't think it works, sadly. I was excited because this would basically make us invincible in the wilderness. Oh, he dismisses when you go into the wilderness. Okay, that's going to make stuff a little trickier here. I still think this is enough Sarah Brews to survive, though. So we're pretty much ready. I got two inventory slots open because I can't actually drop stuff on this account. We need a couple inventory slots in order to actually open the key, but let's head out there. We are ready. So to get to the wilderness chest, no matter the color of the key, they're all the same place. You go to Mage Bank, we head over west, all the way past this little pirate's hideout, and we talk to Grandpa Jack. Take me to the chest, buddy. Oh, there we go. We got a PK right up there. All right, first inventory, first 10 out of 300 keys. Let's see what we get here. No! Okay, hopefully this thing doesn't give us too many doubles. Hopefully it's just the blood money. Oh god, there's so many. No! <laughs> hopefully this is enough inventory space to open eight of them. All right, here we go. Red D had Vans. So what, what's good is hopefully most of them just give us blood money and one item. This is perfect. This is exactly what I wanted. Sometimes they will get noted like ores. And am I just getting red stuff from these keys? Wait, is there actually a difference between these keys when you open them? Okay, that was a terrible inventory. Chest number 9 through 16. Let's see some better items here. Okay, no ores. Don't give me the ores. Oh, God. We're not going to be able to finish this inventory. <laughs> and... A dragon spear now what's good is besides items you get blood money a lot of the times so at the end of the video we'll pull all that together and we'll check out what we can get from the wildy store oh we got an aram's hood i think that's the best thing we got so far we also got some raw rock tails as inventory that's not too bad all right sh come on red key show me your shit show me your good stuff i know you can give me something better than arams you bitch but let's see what you're really hiding in there buddy come on no there can't be nezzies in red d high there's got to be something better Ugh. Not the, not that. All right, well, those red keys weren't too great. We did end up with 31k blood money, but let's move on to the orange ones now. The ne next color in the rainbow. All right, so do different colored wildy keys give you different items? Let's see. Oh, they do. They must, right? Okay, yeah. We're getting orange ones. We're getting some rune stuff now. Interesting. Not as good as dragon stuff, but they're, they're both kind of useless. So, okay, red keys gave me red stuff. This doesn't make sense. Orange keys are giving me blue stuff. And as we all, but we know blue stuff is the best thing to eat, but not necessarily the best items on RuneScape. Hey, we got some lava dragon bones. That's actually good. Ah, oh, Grandpa Jack, you gave me a red item on the orange keys. You know orange is actually blue, silly. Dragon plate skirt. I wonder if that's one of the rare items for the orange keys. Dragon square shield? Question mark. I mean, it can only be uphill from here, right? What are we gonna get from the other color keys, like adamant and shit? I don't think so. And the theme of our yellow keys is red. No, it's adamant. It actually gave me Addy. Oh no, we can't even open them all up because we got all these secondary items. What the fuck? It's, it's actually Addy. How is this possible? <laughs> Look at this. I, I don't even know how I ended up guessing that. Okay, we're getting a lot of secondary stuff too though. It's going to kind of make it harder to open these. <laughs> it's green. Oh, hello there, bullcut god. Oh, he's got the TB. He's got the TB. Okay, we've got to make sure we keep our uh, our protect from magic on so we only get half TB'd. Oh, now I'm teleblocked. He didn't get me. Okay. 2 minute and 30 TB. We should be fine. 8 Cerebrew is not a lot, but since this guy's on normals, he shouldn't... Uh oh, oh, they brought the guy with Barrage out. I mean, we could log out right here, but 
Uh, then I have to wait like 10 minutes for them to leave. Uh, now I gotta wait a two minute TB just to get back in. Okay, wait, maybe if we relog, does the TB go away? Let's see. Yes, it does. Okay, perfect. Very good. All right, last chance, yellow keys, to show us that you're not the worst key. Actually, I think that's already set in stone. <laughs> for the average items, we get to decide on the average item we get. And if the average item is Addy Plate Legs, Adamant Long Sword, it's not looking too good for you, yellow. No, no, no. All right, and the theme of the green keys, let's see. It can't possibly go down to Mithril, can it? Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh my god. It's mithril. It's not all mithril, but it's it's myth. <laughs> it's like, oh my god. Okay. You don't even want if they saw my inventory, he would hop off me immediately. These keys are cursed. The best things we're getting so far, I mean besides the Arams on the first one, a few Barrows items. Uh the blood money's obviously good. Dragon bones and lava dragon bones and a bunch of raw rock tails. It's not the worst. Okay, what do we got here? We've got an arm crossbow. Okay. Oh, he's coming in for the speckle. I won't let you guys get my myth skimitar. It's mine. Oh no. He's going for the TB. I don't have to wait two minutes. Get me in there. Get me in. Ah, it's, uh... Okay, so we are on to the blue and pink keys, which I feel like they got to be better, right? And they look nicer. The, the pink keys especially. I'm looking forward to those. Because what the fuck would pink give me? You know, that's bad. It's free escape. Watch this nerd. It is. He's complaining that he's complaining that I can go into the key area to to escape them. Why <laughs> we get a key? <laughs> they brought over they brought over the, the admin. Oh wait, we got Torax playlegs. Hey, are these gonna be better? Oh shit! The blue keys. It's the blue keys, they give you a barrow's piece every time, and we got infinity boots. Oh here we go. This is what we've been waiting for, guys. These are the good chests. Woo! Wow, okay. Blue keys already in the top tier. But we'll have to wait and see if pink keys are better. But that is a very nice inventory. Now, now they definitely want some of this. Alright, good stuff here. Aram staff. Oh, there we go, we have PvP armors. Oh, it told the fucking server. Okay, we gotta get back now. We might get some big boy PKers out here. Switching off specs and stuff. Okay, give me the rest. So, Zeriel's hood. Oh, Morgan's hood. And Zeriel's top. Jesus Christ. Staff of Light, definitely really good. Ah. And Ranger boots. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. This is the best inventory by far. And we're getting a ton. Oh, wow. We're getting a ton of blood money from these two. Vesta's chain body. It's not corrupt either. And a Malediction shard? All right. Last one, Aram's top. Another Morgan's coif. Okay, those are very common. I'd prefer not hats. Hats are always kind of the worst item. But I'll take it either way. Alright, this is the final inventory of blue keys. I'm kind of sad about that. But let's make it a good last one. There we go, Morgan's body. Not even corrupt. Another coif. Items are coming in hot. And the last key. Oh, we already opened the last key. Alright, there are the blue keys, dude. Look at this tab. My lord. So much good stuff. And it doesn't just give you corrupt. It actually gives you normal as well. And we got a malediction shard. All right, and last but hopefully not least is the pink keys. Uh, we got to the blue and everything got way better. So hopefully these these continue down the same route and we continue getting good stuff because some of those other keys were just were just horrible. Dragon. Brawlers. OK, this is good. Brawlers are good. OK, so these are the are these the brawler keys. These are the brawler keys. Looks like and dragon chain bodies. Oh, somebody's got a key to come in here and fight me. Look at that. Oh, that's scary. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, well, this one's actually actually a little bit trouble here. Luckily, we do have two extra sharks as well, though. We have to click on Grandpa Jack and talk to him to get out. Come on. Okay, we made it. Okay, we're good. We're good. Unless this guy TBs me. And then the other one hops on me with his ancients, but I think I got gap on him. Okay, infinity hat. What are those? Prayer? That's a really good one. Bra prayer brawling gloves. Gloves. Ooh, we got a Zuriel's hood from that one. Nice. Ooh, Stadius Warhammer. That is nice. That might be one of the nicest items we got so far. An actual PvP weapon. It is corrupt, so it's better for pures, but it's still good. Still Warhammer. And some Zuriel's bottoms. My question is, does it get better than this? No, not with that. 
Does it get better? Can we get a VLS? I think that would be basically the best thing we could possibly get. All right, final inventory of the 300 keys we started with. These are the last 10 pinky boys. So far, uh, a lot of the keys are completely fucking worthless, but some of these are really good. These pink and these blue keys were insane. I mean, all Barrow's items. Okay, that's okay. Fuck off. I was just talking good about you. Give me three. I think that's the worst item we can get from these. But brawlers on these ones and PvP items. And then blues just had barrows and PvP items constantly. So this, okay, this was the worst pink inventory of the entire video. To end it off, that's fine though. We got plenty of other good stuff. And we got an insane amount of blood money. I mean, we're getting so much more blood money from these pink and blue keys than we were with the other ones. Alright, so here are the red keys, the first 50 that we opened. Um, we got a few Barrows items, two hoods and one arm staff, um, and then the rest of it's kind of bad. Some good stackables like Rock Tails, Runeite Ore on the orange keys. We went to Rune, and um, yeah, a bunch of Rune stuff. Uh, we do have Lava Dragon Bones. These came from other keys at the same time though, but 239 in total isn't bad. And then the yellow went even more downhill to green items, aka Addy. We did get some Dragon Bones though. Probably the worst key out of all of them, but it picked back up and we went to the blue keys. Look at look at that. Look at this. Green keys to blue keys. Holy shit. Vesta's chain body. Zuriel's top. Three coifs. A corrupt coif. We got almost full sets of each PvP armor. It's crazy. And a lot of other really good stuff as well, like Master Wands. We got Infinity Pieces, Whips, all really nice, and a Malediction Shard. And then lastly, we had the pink keys, which were also pretty good. I mean, we got the Corrupt Stadius Warhammer from them. We got some other PvP armors. I know some of them went into this tab, so we, we did get a few PvP armors from this one. And then a bunch of Brawling Gloves, which can actually be worth quite a lot of money. People that are in Classic accounts have much lower uh, XP rates. So ones for skills like Prayer, Mining, and all of that, for people that are trying to max out their stats, can be very valuable. And 176k blood money in total. Let's go see what we can spend this on. Claws are 85k, so we could buy two of those. That's pretty good. Blood boxes, 25k. See, okay, we're gonna end up buying those for sure, just because they're random chance. We can open some more stuff up. How much are brawling gloves? 10k each. Not bad. AGS is 70k. Okay, looks pretty good. What about Vestas? 30k. Okay, well, let's buy a bunch of blood boxes. We might as well. What can we get from these? Ooh. PvP armors. PvP armors. Oh, we actually get extra blood money when you open those, but not enough Not enough for another chest. So there it is, guys. 300 wilderness keys opened. Every single color of the rainbow. Clearly, some of them are much, much better than others. So if you get your hand on a blue or a pink key, make sure you use those. You can get some really, really good stuff. Either way, though, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to enter the giveaway as well. Like the video if you did enjoy. Subscribe to my channel if you want to be notified when I upload more videos. And have a nice day.